Christine here with another cute, quick, and simple card I made using my Cricut. Today this cute little teddy bear comes from Teddy Bear Parade and he is this cute little fisherman I made for my father, my father-in-law and my husband for Father's Day. They all love to fish so this is a great uh, card for all of them. So I only needed to have one idea this year so I was all excited. And I finally got to use my cute little mustache little gems. So let's go quick today and I'll show you what I've done. I'm going to just mix it up a little bit. I've changed uh, uh, some colors on the third one I'm doing. So this one I started out with some blue cardstock and that's the liner. I'm not finished yet but I have to put um, your great dad in there and I think I'm going to cut out another little fish. I'll bring back my first card and I'll show you what the liner looks like in that one. So it just says happy Father's Day and there's a little fish. Um, but actually the third one which is right here has the nicest um, inside. Uh, and it says to my greatest dad happy Father's Day and so I like that so two of them are going to be these colors and then my third one is going to be different so I started out with some dark blue cardstock I think it is called Midnight Blue it's a Recollections brand and I started out with an eight and a half by eleven I cut it at five and a half inches folded it in half use my bone folder for a crisp fold and it is a standard A2 size card. From there I took some white cardstock and I cut it at four and a uh, four inches by five and a quarter and then I added some pretty blue kind of acid washy color and that is cut down at three inches um, uh, three and three quarter by five and I glued those two together and then I just took a black gel pen and I did two lines instead of my typical one I did two so one on the edge of the white and one on the edge around the other border and I'm just going to take my ATG gun real fast and I'm going to put that in the center of the base of the card getting the adhesive out of the corner. All right, that looks about right. Okay, from there I took this beautiful um, shape and it comes from a Sizzix die cut that I have called Big Notes and I love the stitching that it has and I use the same midnight blue as the background and I'm just gonna glue that straight down as you can see there's kind of a little cloud and that I don't know if you saw my last video but of the little cute choo-choo baby shower card I just had some clouds left over so I think it comes from Simply Charmed and then these little pieces come from the shapes um, from the teddy bear parade the little fisherman that I didn't end up using on the teddy bear alright so let's get to the teddy bear so it's a standard teddy bear. I will get the Cricut right here at the front and I cut him out at three and a half inches. However, on the first card, as I bring it back, it's a little bit bigger. Um, it is three and three quarter inches on this one, but you can use whatever size you want to make this cute little fisherman teddy. So I put the little teddy bear together. He's really, really cute. I did some stitching all around and then I used my cute gem moustache, which is self-adhesive. And just to get the eyes, I just took a white gel pen real quick and I just added a dab in the center to give the eyes a little bit more depth. Now I do have some foam adhesive because I am going to raise him, so whatever you have, pop dots, whatever, you name it, you can use to put your teddy bear so that it has some height. And before I do that, I have also his hat I raised up also. This is the bottom piece. 
and it goes just together just like so and then I am going to add him slightly to the left of the card just like so I think he's so so cute so all my images come out from the bottom right here so I'll bring back the first card um, as you can see so I used all of the images as I said I cut them all out at three and a half inches and the first shape I did in burgundy the second shape in this card I used in blue and then I did the fishing rod in burgundy again I didn't use these pieces and I put them together this card I used a little bit of salmon color and some green for the hat and then I just pieced them together so I didn't use all of the images from the teddy bear but this is the top piece and I just used a gem I added the bend in burgundy and again I raised the top piece of the hat on some foam tape and I'm just going to put him just like that thought it was so so cute I put the vest together and I add another gem. I'm just going to use some two-way glue because I'm not going to raise his little vest. I'm just going to put it on him just like so. thought he was so, so cute. Okay, going quick, but the reason I wanted to really show you this card is basically the little um, fishing rod. I thought it was so, so cute. So I cut it out and right here I used a foam piece but I used some hemp twine. So I stuck the foam piece between the paper and the hemp or I put the hemp and then I put the foam dot down and I'm just going to raise it on his little paw just like so and I twisted the hemp around the fishing rod and then I'm going to bring it down and it's going to attach to this really really cute yet simple little fish and this fish comes from Life's a Beach and uh, actually I have the booklet right here I don't know if you can see real quick there's three fish you can use any one you want I cut it out at two and a half inches this little gray fish I added some eyes to and as you can see is raised on a pop dot also and it's just going to attach the base of the string right here so it looks like he's fishing I thought it was so super super cute and that pretty much finishes my card. I might use some glossy accents in the cloud and I will add some sediments to the liner. But I just wanted to show you this card and what I was up to and hopefully everyone will have a good Father's Day. So, thanks for watching!